We belong to a unique cultural moment when many of us have a complicated relationship with leadership. Whether it is the corruption of a politician, the abuse of an organizational head, or the moral failing of a popular pastor, many of us feel a temptation towards cynicism and distrust. And for those of us in leadership positions, we are wondering how we can be the sort of leader who blesses and serves rather than abuses and controls. Well, all of those questions and more are addressed in the book of 1 Samuel. When God calls a man or woman to anything, whether it is to be a mighty ruler or the mother of a prophet, his criteria has nothing to do with ability, qualifications, or spiritual reputation. What God is most interested in is what we do when we reach the end of ourselves.